Today, I'd like to announce the launch of a new project I've been working on, which is going to help you track your startup or side project expenses. It's going to allow you to see the expenses for each project broken down at a project level. So maybe you're working on a mobile app and a website that are kind of completely two different projects. This is gonna help you keep those separate. Earlier this year, when I was filling out my taxes, I realized that my tax information on my expenses for each of my different projects was kind of scattered around. So the goal of this is actually to have it all in one place and also give me some graphs and metrics that I can use to make decisions within each of my individual projects. Some of these decisions may be to actually shut down a project, or maybe I'll see a trend that I'm spending a lot of money on ads in one project, and those ads aren't really making me the profit that I need to justify paying for them. So this tool is really going to allow you to see a breakdown of each of your projects and how profitable they are. Let me quickly give you a demo of the product, which can be found at onemanstartup.com. So once you're on onemanstartup.com, you'll see kind of the landing page for this and we'll give a little bit more detail about exactly what this project is doing. So let me go ahead and sign into one of my test accounts here. So this is a demo account here. The numbers aren't 100% accurate, but I think just to demonstrate the ability of what this tool can do, you can see simply over here, I have three projects. So these are three different apps that I've worked on and I wanna categorize my expenses separately for each of these projects. So let's say in the Travel Treasury app, I just spent $100 on Facebook ads. I can simply add Facebook ads and type $100 and hit add. And you'll see the Travel Treasury immediately updated to have a profit now of $100 less than it did. And if you go down here, you can see the list of all your expenses that are coming in. So now I have that $100 expense. I can go in here and change this. Maybe I really only spent $10 and you could update that. Another nice thing is this graph here. You can see on a daily basis how much profit you're making. So on May 17th, I made $132 of profit and then haven't made any profit since then. And then today I just lost $10 because of that expense I just put in. Just like the expenses, you can also do incomes. So let's say on Decider, I made some money from the in-app purchases. So I put in-app purchases here and let's say I made $54. I hit add there and you can see the numbers for decider change and then my profit now has changed as well. You can further click into any of your projects and see just the breakdown of that specific project. So I can see the decider has made me $187 of income but I also spent $300 on this project for various things. So that means in total, I've actually lost $114 on this project. And then further, you can go down here and see a breakdown of exactly what you have spent your money on and what you've made money from. This tool just launched. So the features that you see here are the features that are available right now. And this tool is completely free to use. All you have to do is create an account and you'll be able to start adding projects and then adding expenses to those projects. I am gonna be heavily developing this tool over the next couple months, adding the features that I wanna see in it. But I also wanna know what kind of features you wanna see from it. So you can email me anytime, dave at onemanstartup.com and tell me what kind of features that would be useful to you in this tool. This tool is completely free, but if you would like to support the channel, there are a few ways you can do that. All the links are gonna be down below. I have a couple affiliate links that you can use. One that I would like to highlight in this video is for Canva Pro. I actually use Canva to help me design this whole landing page. So a lot of the assets in here, such as these GIFs and some of these other icons, I was able to customize within Canva and export them easily and then use them right within my app. You can start a free trial of the pro version. If you use the link below, it will help support the channel. Let me know what you think about this new project down in the comments and feel free to email me any features that you're also looking to see in the coming days. All right, that's gonna be it for this video. Ciao for now.